The Public Authority for Special Economic Zones and Free Zones, OPAS, held its annual media meeting. The purpose of this meeting is to highlight the achievements of OPAS and the regions under its supervision in 2023, as well as to outline the total targets and plans for 2024. This year it was about the achievement of uh, 2023 uh, in the authority and also within our partners in the other zones, uh, be it uh, free zones, uh, special economic zone and industrial uh, cities. Uh, we have uh, given a brief about our achievement in terms of bringing a new investment to this state, about the number of employees that we have also about our new project if, uh, can we uh, project about developmental project in the states also the programs that we have created to attract new investors about the investment uh, opportunities one of the key topics discussed during the media meeting was the growth of investments in several vital sectors including green energy metal pharmaceutical and petrochemical industries. OPAS currently oversees a total of 22 areas, which include 14 special economic zones such as the Special Economic Zone at Dukum and Khazain Economic City, three free zones including the Sohara Free Zone, Salala Free Zone and Al Mazuna Free Zone, and nine industrial zones operated by the Public Establishment for Industrial Estates Medayin. Additionally, eight other zones are currently being developed to two of which are economic zones, and the rest are free zones. Furthermore, there are five industrial zones spread across various governorates of the Sultanate of Oman. Today, uh, we've been able to share our uh, 2023 uh, performance, uh, which resulted mainly in a key milestone, like uh, attracting of 727 million real Omani of FDI in different business sectors, Currently, our F total FDI reached 4.7 uh, billion real Omani. This year has been remarkable. I mean, we have uh, registered over 60% in terms of growth. The fact is, this is something that is uh, it's just uh, a remarkable one. And, and we are now, just to make sure that we see some of these projects we're talking about start materializing in Dukum, and we're looking to other projects that are also associated with this project. The most critical thing we're looking at most of those projects to the downstream part as well as the IC fee of those projects. So this is will put Dukum actually as another hub of, of another business hub and also will create the real industrial base in Dukum to connect Dukum to the rest of the, the region as well as the global market. The most prominent achievements of uh, Khazain Economic City last year 2023 is uh, uh, the total investments value in, in, in the city uh, reached uh, 430 million real Omani. We, ha we are focusing in uh, very major economic sectors uh, such as the, uh, the logistic sectors, uh, pharmaceutical sectors, uh, as well as the, uh, the food sectors, uh, industrial sectors. We have uh, managed to attract FDIs uh, in Khazain uh, with a total value of 580 mil uh, million uh, US dollar uh, and also the local uh, investment has reached almost 420 million uh, US dollar. It's noteworthy to mention that OPAS announced during its annual media meeting that the cumulative committed investment in all regions until the end of December 2023 amounted to approximately 19 billion Armani Rials. OPAS leads the way with new achievements in their special economic zones and free zones here within the Sultanate of Oman. This was revealed during their media meeting of 2024. For Oman TV, Ahmed bin Hilal al-Busaidi, Masqat.